improved methods of agriculture. With the increase of population, our requirement of food grains has also increased manifold. This increased demand of food grains can only be fulfilled by the utilization of improved methods of agricultural practices. These are Improved Varieties of Seeds Improved seed variety is one of the most important agricultural practices to increase the yield. This is done by plant breeding. Plant breeding It is the practical application of genetic principles to the development of improved agriculture and horticultural crops. The varieties have been improved at various research centers. Indian Council of Agricultural Research, ICAR, Indian Agricultural Research Institute, IARI, and various agricultural universities are the important centers for improvement of varieties. The main objectives of these are 1. To increase the yield of desired products such as food, oils, fodder, etc. 2. To increase the quality of crops as size, color, shape, taste, etc. 3. To produce varieties that is resistant to diseases. 4. To get early maturing crop. Improved agricultural implements. Old agricultural implements have become outdated. They require more labor but give less output. Hence, advanced implements are being used. Tractor is a multi-purpose implement which is a boon for agriculture. Other important implements are plow, harrow, soil plank, leveler, seed drill, trowel, scarecrow, knapsack sprayer, sickle, harvester, thresher, combine, winnower, scrapper, axe, water wheel, swinging basket, sprinkler, etc. Rotation of crops Rotation of crops is one of the most important and old agricultural methods. If the same crop is grown continuously, the yield of crops is reduced. This is because the plants get nutrients from the same level of soil and ultimately particular nutrients are used up. This deficiency can be overcome by rotation of crops. Generally, a pulse crop is grown after a cereal crop so that the fertility of soil may be restored. In crop rotation, different types of crop are grown in succession on the same land. Organic farming It is an agricultural practice of growing crops without the use of synthetic chemicals. Instead of chemical fertilizers and pesticides, biofertilizers are used. Organic farming does not alter the composition of the soil. It increases the nutrients and water holding capacity of the soil. It reduces the harmful chemicals present in the soil and converts barren land into fertile land. The organic manure does not harm the soil or the crop even in excess quantity. Seed Certification Seeds should be free from all the contaminants. Healthy and disease-free seeds should be used for cultivation. Such seeds are called certified seeds. Seeds should be treated with some fungicides before sowing. Crop protection from disease In India, there is about 10% loss in yield due to crops diseases alone. Crops should be protected from the diseases caused by fungi, bacteria, viruses and insects and accordingly suitable pesticides should be used. In storehouses also, seeds are protected from the attack of insects, fungi and rats, etc. Highly toxic pesticides should not be used because they have side effects and fatal to crops and human health. Examples of some pesticides are Malathion, Endrin, BHC, Gamexine, DDT, etc. Due to side effects of pesticides, scientists have developed a special class of pesticides which kill only specific pests without affecting other organisms. These are prepared from living organisms and are called biocides. Depending upon the purpose for which they are used, they may be of these types. 1. Herbicides Pesticides that kill only herbs. 2. Fungicides 
pesticides that kill only fungi. 3. Insecticides, pesticides that kill only insects. 4. Bactericides, pesticides that kill only bacteria. 5. Rodenticides, pesticides that kill only rats. 6. Biocides, biopesticides kill only specific pests without any side effects to crop or environment. Biological Control of Pests Due to harmful effects of pesticides on organisms, some alternative methods of pest control are being used nowadays. That is, use of other organisms to kill the pests is called biological pest control. These organisms are called biopesticides or biocides. They may be 1. Bioherbicides control the herbs. 2. Bioinsecticides control the insects. 3. Biofungicides control the fungi. Multiple cropping. To increase the yield, cultivation of several crops, 3 to 4, in a year have been suggested. This is called multiple cropping. We should select some early maturing crops of different types in the same field. Know this. Bananas are the fourth largest overall crop after wheat, rice and corn. India grows more bananas than any other country in the world. Mixed Cropping When two or more crops are grown together in the same field, it is called mixed cropping. This method is important in the sense that sometimes one crop fails due to disease, flood or drought, then the other crop can be obtained and there is no overall loss in the yield. Hybrid Seeds the crossing of different parents is called hybridization. It combines the desirable characters of two or more varieties. When two different varieties of plants are crossed, a new variety of plant is developed called hybrid. The seeds obtained from such plants are called hybrid seeds. Hybrid seeds are more improved varieties to increase the yield, size, quality and fruiting. However, Sometimes it is a disadvantage and purity of character is not maintained for long time.